Hello and welcome to a new player review. We have a lot of new players today, a lot of new content. Uh, nice content, I think, very nicely done by EA. We had uh, objectives, SPCs, new prime icons, so a lot of stuff to see. We already reviewed uh, anti rebage the fitness card, so this video is up on the channel, check it out. And I thought of doing another player. Um, so the other options were David De Gea, for a 90 rated card you need an 84 rated SPC, so that will come around 45 to 50k which for me, I think it's a no-brainer. You should go do this SPC. You're just basically paying for a 90 rated card because I think the cheapest one should be around 45K um, and you get a 90 rated David Hair. Even I will go do him and I don't need him right now in the club, but maybe in some future changes that I might do, I might need a card like that and you will not get a second chance to do this card as he's only out for 24 hours. So if you have the funds available or their players, untradeable, stuff like that. I think you should go do it. If you don't need them in the future, you can submit them to an SPC and it's gonna be the same as purchasing a 90 rated card. So uh, it's a win-win situation in that. So the other player that was available was this uh, Jerome Roussillon. I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly, uh, from Wolfsburg. Looks like a very nice card and um, a league that uh, needs um, very badly some good fullbacks. So here we can see his main stats, which is a 175, uh, 59 or something like that. A high medium, which is not uh, something I like with my fullbacks because I always play him on stay back while attacking. So this is not a good work rate to have. But again, I think putting them on stay back while attacking overrides these work rates. So uh, there's no harm in done when you have fullbacks with these kind of work rates. Now, if we go into the details, you can see uh, I already applied an anchor. I was be between the anchor and the sentinel and the trade-off there was that I will lose uh, three more in a standing tackle and five more in slide tackle to gain five and five acceleration and sprint speed. So I thought it was a good trade-off to put an anchor on this guy instead of a sentinel. So as you can see with the anchor, he goes to 93 acceleration and 97 sprint speed. So which is fantastic with this card, very fast. Uh, his passing is very good, um, 75 vision, 88 crossing, 81 uh, short pass, 74 long pass, and 77 curve, um, which are good stats and really don't need any improvement to play for your fullback. Uh, dribbling is also another good stat, 82 overall with 78 agility, 79 balance and reactions, 83 ball control, 82 dribbling, and 78 composure. Again, very good stats here that you can go without uh, any camp style applied to these. I think it will work out very good uh, just as it is in the dribbling area. Uh, and the defending and physical are the two most important stats for your defenders. So these are the areas that you always have to improve with some camp styles. So with the anchor that we applied, we have interceptions that go to 87, his heading accuracy to 85, his defensive awareness to 89, his standing tackle to 96, and his slide tackle to 94. So this already looks like a very good card uh, defensive wise and in his physical we get plus 10 in jumping so he goes to 83 87 stamina which is fantastic it will go a full 120 minutes and he will still have more left over we go to 83 strength and 87 aggression so all in all these improved stats look very good on this card i really really like it unfortunately i don't have that many bundesliga players in the club that are good that i can play except this uh, royce that i got today from a player pick which I was very lucky. I only did like four or five and I got this guy in the first one. Uh, but I, it's not something I can put in the team and make it really viable at the moment. So we're gonna play it like this and we'll put Benzema here to get that link. So as usual, we're gonna go into two games uh, for champions and test this guy out and see how good this card really is. So here we are with the first team that we're gonna face, a very nice Serie A team uh, full of special cards, Politano, Mertens, Papa Gomez, that SPC that pretty much nobody did, but those that did it are laughing now. Uh, very good solid team full of special cards, so I think it's going to be a hard uh, team to crack with fast attackers. So we're probably going to see Rusi Young's uh, defensive capabilities in this game. There he is, first touch, very nice. Pass, very good pass. Pass there, gets inside, goal, oh, wow, very nice goal. The chance created by Rusi Young, here we go again, very good standing tackle there, wins the ball. Rusi Young 
there. Very nice control. So we're in the area. Break. Oh no. That was my bad. <laughs> but Bruce Young was there to correct it. Very good there. Very good ball. Short that. And goal by Benzema. Wow. Very good. Fantastic work by Rusi Young so far. I'm very impressed. Even uh, correcting my mistake. Let's make a good ball. It's good. Yes, it's good. Come on. Yeah. Something good. Let's see that speed. Nice dribble. Come on, Guadalvo there. Can't be pushing him around. Oh. Okay, Rusi on there, correct the red stake again. All right, very good first half there for Rusi I really liked him, really, really liked this guy a lot. Uh, very good defensively. Um, he made some good tackles, very good awareness. His positioning is very nice. Uh, his standing tackle was excellent, um, especially that one mistake that I did in the area uh, where I was trying to sort of dribble the ball in the area and I lost it. Russo Young was there to recover it very fast, so it was very nice. 9 on 10 passes, 7 on 8 dribbles, and 2 on 2 tackles. So very nice from Russo Young in the first half. Let's go into the second half and see more of this card. Fast. Very nice back with this. Come on. Oh, come on. Use for Young. Oh, what a tackle there. Very nice. Go get us. Let's go. Very nice attack. Let's see what you can do. Yes. Oh, very good. Oh. Yes. Nice dribble by Roussillon. Get the ball out and a fantastic pass. Again we chip and it's out. There we go. And score. This is Roussillon. Very good heading. So yeah. There he is. Let's see if he's good. The offense as well. Uh, oh, here we go. A rage quit. I don't think he should have rage quit on the 84th minute. It was only five minutes left. He could have waited that out. Anyways, we're here to see this Rusi Young, which I was really, really impressed with this guy. Uh, fantastic performance. 12 of 14 passes, 10 of 13 dribbles, and 3 of 4 uh, tackles won. Uh, was a fantastic, fantastic uh, performance by Russo Young. I really, really like this card. So we need to go into another game right away and play this guy once more and see if this was a one-off or he really is this good. So here we are with the second team. A very nice Trem team. There's that new David De Gea, which is, like I said, a card that you need to go and do if you have the funds available with the players. Just go do this guy. Uh, good attack. We'll see if we can do the same here. Let's see if Roussillon is as good as he was in the first game. Here we go. Yes, very nice step in. Again, but Guedes there ruined the tackle. There we go, Roussillon. Good pass. Quintano. Yes, there we go, Benzema again. Wow. Very good tackle again, Roussillon. There we go, have a great touch. Another dribble there. All right, great first half by Roussillon again. Uh, I really can't find any flaws in this guy. Uh, can't find any mistakes that he makes. I don't think he does any mistakes. 
or he hasn't done any so far in the first game and in this uh, second game first half. Three on three passes, three on four dribbles, and three on three tackles. I mean, this guy is fantastic, especially uh, defensively, is a great player so far. I'm really, really liking this card. There he is. He's giving us a space to see the cross. Not that great. What? How did that go in? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I thought it was going out. What is this shot with his left foot? Oh <laughs> my god, EA. What are you doing? Get it. Come on, dude. It's stuff like this that this game does that takes the fun out of it. I mean, already I was having so much fun with his Rusihan and now I like, completely don't want to play this game anymore. Wow. Explosive speed there. <laughs> so frustrating, man, this game. So frustrating. So let's get back to reviewing this Rusian after that uh, frustrating break there. All right, there we go. There he is. Very explosive. Look at that Rusian. Oh, wow. Look at that speed. Pass. Good shot. Oh, why, 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 why? Such a good play. Wow, he won't even lose the ball there. Look at this player, dude. See, come on. Can't even get your see up there. Oh, and he got it. Wow. He even managed to get that. Wow. What a finale for Roussillon. All right, so we got the win and the second game as well. Um, get an assist. Okay, so we had five and seven passes, six or nine dribbles. Uh, most of the failed ones were at the end where I was trying a bit too, too much with him. And four and four tackles. So his tackling is 100% there, which is fantastic. I'm really impressed with this card. Uh, let's go back and have a look at it. So, uh, here is this guy. I'm, I'm really impressed with this guy. I think it's this is a fantastic left back and it's also free. Uh, you can get this guy in objectives. I think you should go and do this guy right away. If he fits in your team right now, I think you should probably stop your foot champions games and go and do this guy and add him in your team right away. Um, he was fantastic defensively. I don't think he missed a beat. He was there. Uh, he every tackle he did he saved uh, two goals I think one in the first game and one in the second game at the end there uh, where he came from way up way out in the field and he managed to get in front of the goal and uh, save us from uh, conceding a goal his uh, work was fantastic his defensive awareness his positioning uh, he is AI off the ball movement was fantastic always where he needed to be uh, he wasn't pushing off the field uh, so don't get fooled about those work rates. I had him on stay back while attacking, and so that's where he stayed the whole game. Um, very, very nice. I'm very, very impressed with this guy um, to the point that I really want to use him in the team somehow. So I really need to find a way to put this guy in the team because I think this was a fantastic card. This is a card that you really should need to go start grinding and get it in your team as soon as possible. So this is going to be it for this review. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.